as i said this city is if you understand the most fascinating please understand this city is literally cosmos if you understand you will find such a great order in the chaos if you don't you will find chaos so much of chaos in everything the person who understands for them this city is most fascinating if you don't understand this will be most frustrating just like life just like life if you understand most fascinating if not most frustrating varanasi anandavana is just mirror mahadeva shows to you when you see the mirror you can be frustrated you can plan for your threading and make up or you can do completion it's all up to you varanasi is the mirror mahadeva shows to you if you understand this is the most fascinating city if not most frustrating city here bulls dogs beggars sadhus great paramahamsas dead bodies snakes all of us walk together in small lanes criss crossing each other again and again with shoulder to shoulder all of us have to live together you can't avoid anyone and the beauty is no one hurts each other everyone is happy to be in other space i tell you i never had even one thought this city is dirty or too congested never ever had one thought if you go to that original anandavana there is no street which is more than 3 feet please understand 3 feet width actually i was contemplating why i read some of the history books they are saying the city was planned and built before the before even the bullock cart was discovered but i was not ready to believe that i consciously scanned the akashic records i tell you kalbhairav revealed very clearly now whatever we are using as a road is just drainage the city was created for the people who had naturally the ability of flying so we never bothered to create roads that was the response from kal bhairava we never had roads because we never had people who were walking originally when the city was formed it was not planned for the people who are walking on the ground it was planned <laughs> for the rishis gandharvas kinnara kimburada gana ganadyas who were naturally flying who had the power of levitation and flying 
they were living here so we never had the need for road the buildings are just the place where they assumed the human body and taught this science or learned this science learned from the masters taught to disciples so this was the oldest city oldest university oldest hospital and oldest monastery and what not all the rishi muni gana kinnara kimburuda gandharva gandara deva siddha vidyadara life of kashi and on behalf of the very source itself i welcome all of you to this sacred city and you need to know they are all very happy celebrating your presence they are all really 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 happy to have all of us here this is the place where all the spiritual freaks gather from time immemorial understand the word paramahamsa i am translating as spiritual freaks you may think the word looks too low but i tried i could not find any other word in english so i am okay with that word from time immemorial sadhus nahas siddhas paramahamsas gather to celebrate life and celebrate death here life is liberation death is celebration life is liberation death is celebration this city is built out of all our sacred sentiments that is why every king of bharat from gandhara afghanistan to bali indonesia every king has their palace here whether nepal king or bhutan burma of course burma doesn't have a king now when they had nepal also doesn't have a king now when they had from gandhara to bali all the kings have their palace here all the great jagat gurus pitadishwas masters have their ashram or monastery here this whole city is built not just with mud stone wood mortar it is built with our sacred sentiments that is why ramakrishna says this city is golden city because all our sacred sentiments are filled and this city is built 